trade conflicts, pandemic, and geopolitical tensions have all had an impact on global supply chains. It's time to rethink how these crucial production links are set up and how they can be made more resilient. Having said that, we'll be looking at Asian Development Bank's blog article on how to reorganize world's fragile supply chains. Time is right to rejigger global supply chains. One school of thought is to diversify those further away from places prone to disruptions due to economic, health, climate change, and political issues. The other is bringing the production capacity back to the home country, known as onshoring, or to countries nearby, known as nearshoring. Benefits of diversification transcend sheer cost minimization. They also involve gains from risk mitigation and securing backup sourcing plans. In rejiggering supply chains, governments should consider first, ensuring needs to be pursued in a selective and efficient way. Second, reshoring strategy may not solely target outsourced production capacities of domestic companies. Third, diversification motives may not be based solely on cost efficiency, but should consider risk management perspectives as well. Lastly, while governments intend to rejigger supply chains could be effective in jumpstarting businesses motivation to reshow or diversify. This may not ensure long-term sustainability of such approaches, given that subsides tend to ameliorate fixed costs for investment or tax payments, not operational costs. With that, we'll be concluding the presentation. Thanks for watching.